Henry. How are you this morning? Fine, I guess. It's Monday after all. <laughs> I guess so. Let's grab some coffee before our shift starts. Sounds good to me. We've got a lot of deliveries to make today. Drive safe, Maria. I'll see you back at the depot. Five more packages and I'm done. Holy cow! I'm calling 911. Is anybody hurt? 911, what's your emergency? At around 4 p.m. today, a vehicle explosion rocked a city street, injuring multiple civilians and inflicting massive damage on surrounding vehicles and property. We have multiple injured civilians needing immediate medical. My team and I need to investigate and find out what exactly happened and why. Our team just confirmed that the explosion was caused by an explosive device planted in the vehicle and detonated remotely. After a thorough investigation, we discovered this incident was a planned attack against an internet influencer who'd been visiting the nearby coffee shop. Target recently promoted a scam product, after which he began receiving threatening communications. The goal of our investigation will now begin to focus on the individual or individuals behind this attack. My buddy's got some news for you. For the last couple of months, I've been playing a cool game that I believe everyone watching this video will enjoy. One state is a game where you can roleplay any kind of character you want. You have a lot of choices for jobs such as being a policeman, gangster, part of an army, food delivery, taxi driver, street racer, and a lot of more. You can customize your vehicles to the top and you're able to choose some various cars. Everyone will find their taste. This game allows you to play with thousands of players online and you can create companies together. What's the best, this is all playable on phone. Game is perfectly optimized, so even if your phone is not the best, you can still play. And what's even better, the game is free to download. If you use my code BMNGTV, you will get a starter pack of 10,000 in-game currency. So join now and play with me. Gas on pump 5, please, and a pack of cigarettes. I wish I could quit my job and still have enough money for whatever I want. Then I could just do whatever I want. Hi there. Taxi for Susan? That's me. Downtown, please.
Hi there, Robert. Yep, let's go. I need to get some groceries real quick. Then I've got another destination. You got it, buddy. Step on it before I shoot you in the head. Did you just rob that grocery store? Stop asking questions. Just go. Go where? It doesn't matter anywhere. Okay, stop. Have some money. You never saw me. Got it? Yeah, man. What? Whatever. Currently, we have an address for the taxi driver who was participating in this robbery. Police, open up. Don't shoot. I know, I know why you're here. Hands behind your back, you're under arrest. No problem. I'll tell you everything. Based on our interview with the cab driver, we understand that the robber threatened him with a firearm aimed at his head. His actions were compliance under duress. He provided us with dash cam footage proving he was acting against his will. He's free to go. This bad show me 10 aid in service. One day, I was driving my semi-truck from Tennessee to California. It was a long route, but I needed the money and this gig was gonna pay. I headed out early in the morning and, like every other trucker, I managed to avoid taking our mandatory breaks. It was like any other afternoon. I was on my way to my daughter's school to bring her home. She always has after-school activities. That day, something happened that I never expected. I reached for a snack, knowing I wouldn't have the opportunity for a real meal for a while. That's when it happened. I was terrified. This man shall be 1076 to that collision. Send more units for traffic. Dispatch, this is worse than we thought. Six vehicles involved, multiple injuries, possible fatality. The only thing I remember is a loud boom. And then I woke up and heard my daughter crying. I was knocked out. When I came to, I was waking up to the huge mess I made. We were lucky to survive at all. Dispatch, confirm multiple injuries, one fatality. It's been 24 hours since a teenager was reported missing. A citizen reported that they'd seen someone injured walking through their neighborhood. We conducted a thorough search, but we were unable to find anyone. Then, we received a call from someone claiming to be the missing person's friend. 
He stated that he'd received a phone call from him. Our techs are working on the call and trying to trace the location. Police were able to locate the missing teenager after a search that lasted 13 hours. He'd been hiding in a park, and the only explanation he offered was that he'd wanted to get away from everything after becoming depressed. Okay, kids, I'm heading to the store. Clean the house until I get back. A road rage incident spiraled out of control, leading to a tragic multi-vehicle accident. A woman wasn't watching the road ahead and rear-ended a trailer before being rear-ended by a van and a semi-truck. The driver of the van survived with minor injuries. We received a report of a massive fire on the highway. A car had collided with a fuel tank. First responders were hit by a massive shockwave when a fuel tanker exploded. Firefighters were trying to extinguish a vehicle fire when the massive explosion occurred. Multiple people were injured, including several first responders. Finally, some nice weather. A delivery driver like me can't ask for anything better. Here's your pizza. Enjoy! Come on! Now my customers will be getting a cold pizza. Man, this is gonna be close! This customer is pretty far away. I'll be driving to the Italian hills for this one.
No, my brakes aren't working! A food delivery driver was making his last delivery of the day when his brakes failed while he was going downhill. He's been transported to the hospital and is now fighting for his life in critical condition. Be sure to subscribe for more news.